Candace Lynn here for RoboZone. We're out at the Livonia event, so that is the Livonia Warriors home event today. I have Connor with me. Connor, tell me, what's your role on the team? Um, my role is mechanical captain for the Warriors team. So what kind of responsibilities do you have in the creation of the robot or maybe just some of the mentoring and getting it ready for today? A lot of my um, responsibilities revolve around making sure that everyone is, um, all of the students are doing their jobs properly. I do fabrication, I do a lot of random technical maintenance stuff. I don't do much electrical or programming, however, as long as it's built, it's on the robot and it's fabricated, I do parts assembly and I do parts fabrication. So I'll either be in the fabrication room or I'll be helping assembling the robot. Great, so how do you feel the robot's doing today? The robot is actually doing very good this year as opposed to many other times, I guess. Usually I have some slight anxiety and this year it's actually doing pretty well. Everything's working as it should be and there's no major er, issues that I can think of. Great, do you have a favorite element of your robot that you feel kind of sets you apart from the other teams? Our favorite elements? I don't know about a singular specific element. I know this year though, we got a new CNC machine. So a lot of this year's robot has actually been based around precision. So everything we did on this robot mostly has either been custom, in-house, or other things like that. So for the um, robot arms themselves though, those were West Coast design. However, there were no West Coast stock at the time. So we all built that all in-house and used either the mill or the CNC to cut out all of those parts. The slipstream as well was also done in-house and we also built a custom um, gearbox with a 16 to one ratio to help with the climbing arms. So with that, what's your favorite part of being on a robotics team? That is a hard one. However, definitely the hands-on experience that comes with this. The most fun parts are just brainstorming with a bunch of other kids and coming up with what you really want to build. Because like at the very beginning of the season, it's just kind of a mess of like trying to figure out what exactly you want to do. But watching it come together is probably one of the most enjoyable experiences. Yeah.